Hello everyone, my name is Alyssa. In this video, this video is addressed to my twin flame, Shia. Hi, Shia. And whoever else is watching, I thank you for watching, but this is going to be a lot of crime against me and my twin flame, Shia. But there's going to be some other things I'm going to talk about. And by the way, I just want to let you know, um, Shia and who else is watching, and I'm going to say Shia's name a lot if someone else is watching, or if other people are watching. I am uh, demonically possessed, so there's going to, I'm going to be saying things that I might not, I might not have, um, I'm not, might not be supposed to be saying, so they're going to mess up my words, um, they're going to really try to mess up this video, <sighs> um, and I have had a very, uh, bad several few days, but Shia, um, I just want you to know, um, they're, they're tr already trying to control the conversation. So, Shia, I have everything laid out on my thing of what I'm going to talk to you about. I actually spent all day today printing out notes from past notebooks that with messy handwriting so I can easily read them. And so that when we're together, you're not going to have to go read through messy handwriting. And I, I won't either. So they're going to play with my voice. I got a cut here in the kitchen a couple of days ago and it's, it really hurts. Sliced. And then every time I get a like, cut or bruise, they, the criminals say, Oh, that's, that's a spell working. That was supposed to be you dead. So... Uh, they were uh, trying to make me, before I, I put this video video on Shia, they're trying to make me act like I'm being rude to you, I'm not talking about your life, I'm, I'm, but I, like I told you, I'm, I'm possessed, so I'm doing the best that I can. Um, I have a lot of notes that you're going to be uh, happy for me to talk about. I'm going to tell you, uh, I wrote a little sticky note of the things that I'm going to talk about in this video, and I'm going to talk about our, our cookbook, Shia, photos of the food I ate since Wednesday, uh, some of my doctor's notes, because on the 13th, which is Monday, I'm going to go to the doctor's uh, to see if I can get some uh, spine and uh, another brain scan and if not I have a new physician that will most likely give me a brain scan because of the, the way he wrote the little checks so they're gonna play with my boy voice Shia and uh, they were very 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 angry today I have had these past 48 hours I've had I had five hours six hours straight of gas torture yesterday um, I was raped for many hours today, rape tortured, uh, because I was printing out the notes and Shia. The reason why I write in notebooks is because obviously uh, the criminal, um, it's much too stressful. If I, if I download uh, deliverance prayers, PDF deliverance prayers, the criminal deed. D W D A V I D W O L F E tells me that he's going to swap them uh, and swap. He's going to change the wording and then put it back in, and I wouldn't notice. He tells me that everything on my computer is rigged. All my social media is fake. Uh, he told me today and yesterday he's going to delete all my social media. Um, he told me today that. If I say a f some a few, I didn't do that. If I say some things that I'm not supposed to, that he doesn't want me to talk about, uh, he's going to throw acid on my face. Um, so, oh yeah, and uh, that this video is not going to go through. There's no way that Shy is going to see this video. I'm wearing this sweatshirt, Shia, because I've been feeling very ill and I just kind of wanted to be very comfortable. Also, I didn't really want to show my arms. Um, 
because they always make my make me reach up and I just don't feel like showing my arms. It's extremely humiliating to have to see those photos with my arms like that. So I, I'm going to, if I don't act extremely angry and stressful, it's because I've, I've just like, I can't. And you can't either, Shia. Uh, I know, Shia, that you're very sick as well as me, and I'm not being, like, acting like it's all about me. And I've written, I'm gonna, I'm gonna talk about caretaking you in this video. Oh, oh, that's, that noise is someone visiting my website. Uh, it says Philippines. I love seeing all the different countries visiting my website. So, cookbook, photos of food, brain health, notes. I wrote a few things that uh, I want both of us to do. New notes. Uh, printed notes, caretaking, Shia's situation, about Shia, brain health. Oh, there's something else. So that's that's the list. I'm going to stick stick it right here. I'm going to go into the order because they're going to make me want to sit just blurt things out. However, Shia, I'm, I. Obviously, this has been on, this is kind of on my mind. Uh, I changed my Facebook social media. I was uh, controlled to keep the same photos for many, many years, and those photos were had witchcraft on them. So anytime I saw the photos, my face would start burning and like blushing, and I'd stop breathing. So this possession uh, made me not change the photos. And I was told that this is the only professional photo that you have of yourself, so you can't change it. Just like usual. So on this this video is only going to be a half an hour because I want to make sure that you don't wait around. Um, So first I'm going to talk about the cookbook. It's not really a cookbook, but it's going to be a reference book. Ugh. I just stretched out the video and I don't like it like that. Shia, by the way, I put the ocean waves. I put the ocean waves on instead of the ocean sea creatures. Last video, I'd never turned this on and it made me very sad that I never noticed that it was off. It made me very sad. I actually cried. And I knew that it was going to bother you. So the possession could have made me not look and, and notice. I've been trying really hard to um, I've been trying really hard to not be overwork myself because with the possession that's what they do with me, my body and my mind so Shia this is going to make both of us weaker knowing that something happened to my brain So this week, I now uh, have this much notes of food research. So this this uh, this book cookbook is it's not called a cookbook, but I'm not going to call it a food book. I don't really know what to call it yet because it's not just a recipe title keeper. Uh, you're going to ha uh, type uh, help me type this, and you're going to have you're going to like this. I think it would be funner to see f photos though, so we'll have to find a way to, so that when you type it, I, I'll show you the, what they look like, the rest of the recipes. So I've been doing a bunch of research. I wrote down notes, but this week I'm, I actually collected cheapest foods from Aldi and Walmart. 
Uh, Aldi is supposed to be the cheapest grocery store and I'm not allowed to go there. They make me afraid. However, you can buy uh, the cheapest stuff there and I think they're a little bit Christian. They have some Psalms on some of their products. And they have really nice names for their food brands. Like Friendly Farms and just really like... I don't think it's an evil grocery store. Uh, Walmart is also... They have a, a great selection and the prices you cannot beat the prices. Uh, Trader Joe's is good but you're not gonna... can't really get a variety so I don't want to just keep rambling on because we have more important ta things that I need to talk to you about. But I wanted to say some happy things before I started talking about the negative stuff, the evil stuff, the crime. Uh, I'm looking up cheapest foods because I wrote this down in the notes. I was kept from being able to eat on a budget for uh, because it's it was part of my lack of survival to get grossed out by uh, cheap foods. Um, and not just grossed out. I wasn't allowed to eat canned food because uh, it was in a can. Uh, just a lot of things. But even my, my mother started it. My mother was never very well off, but she never bought cheap food. And I actually don't believe it was because she couldn't afford to buy inexpensive food. I can't go into it right now because I don't remember off the top of my head, but we're going to talk about it in the notes, Shia. So I'm doing uh, researching food, so when you when I meet with you, Shia, I'm going to know how we can uh, shop on a budget and eat on a budget. I've This is the first time I've been able to cook food, prep food, and put it in the freezer. First time in 37 years. I don't know why I've never thought to. Now, I, not now. Uh, I have notes here um, about it. So, basically, there's an extreme possession, Shia, with me and food, and I've been s organizing and spending so much time creating a grocery list in meal plans. I have not been able to make meal plans or eat a meal. A, a meal that's like a meal with three items. Like the protein, the vegetable, and the carbohydrate. I've, I was possessed, unable to do that. They really play with my diet with starvation and uh, unbalanced diet, witchcraft spells on the food and how I eat the food. So I've been doing a ton of research on uh, food, eating on a budget because uh, all they do is steal all my money through food for years and years and years. I mean, when I worked those retail jobs, I was basically just working to eat. So. And also, this is the first time in 37 years where I can write a grocery list that's ingredients for meals. Uh, they've possessed my body and forced me to write grocery lists of things that I just want to have. I have proof, Shia, in the notebooks and in this folder of grocery lists I have made where they scramble my brain. They say, you just have to go to the grocery store. You have to rush. You have to go can't write ingredients down for specific meals. Uh, it's been an it's extreme problem. It's been an extreme problem and they're playing with my voice. So it's an extreme problem that I have not been able to um, meal plan and buy make grocery lists off of meals. Well, oh, so I'll give you an example. I'll just buy random things compulsively, things that I just want to have, and they don't end up making a meal. <laughs> They're just random foods. So I'm, I've, I'm getting really, like, 
With all of this food research, I've also realized that everybody has to have beverages, snacks, lunch, dinner, breakfast foods. And I'll go to the grocery store and I'll buy a box of cereal and nothing else for breakfast, but then I'll buy a bunch of other things that has nothing to do with breakfast, and then I'm always running out to the grocery store because I'm, I'm craving something, and it's because I, I don't have balanced uh, ways of eating. I don't have, like, the first year living here, they deprived me of snacks. So I think, um, no, I, I don't want to just talk randomly about that, but for, for breakfast, pancakes, oatmeal, cereal, and then the traditional breakfasts like eggs, toast, potatoes, uh, turkey sausage or beef sausage, hash browns, those types of breakfasts. So I'm getting... There's, I, there's spells involved, so it's not like... There's a lot of possession and spells involved and demons that are still possessing me to make this like impossible. However, I am doing it. And then when I did start meal planning or trying to meal plan, I would write down like 30 meals. And then I would go to the store without cr writing down the ingredients of the meals. Or one time I did, but then I wrote like 100, 50 to 100 in ingredients and I couldn't buy all the 50 to 100 ingredients. It's just, it's absolutely ridiculous. No, uh, I didn't say it's absolutely ridiculous. So I am going to, like for Thanksgiving, did remember how I told, rattled off like seven or eight different items for Thanksgiving meal. Well, I can't do that. I, I, and that's not, get it, go away. Die in the name of Jesus immediately, whoever's talking through my, talking through me. Die in the name of Jesus immediately. You get a death penalty in Islam for what you're doing to me, and you're going, you're going to, the, the country, the whole world's going to change, and they're going to take that. So, not, I'm not, Shia didn't say that, and every, anyone else who's watching. So, and they're telling me repeatedly, the only two people that are watching are you and my mother. And if my, if you're watching, if other people, if my mother is watching, I can't, I'm not going to tell her not to. That'll make her want to watch it. So I'm not going to tell anybody to watch it or not watch it. So, but there's more people than just my mom and you, shy of watching my video. Um, not, um... So I, I just got interrupted. Oh yeah, I, I told you I want rolls, green bean casserole, cauliflower and cheese, stuffing, turkey. Uh, and then what am I going to eat for the rest of the month? Thanksgiving for three weeks? It's That's gross. So there's a lot of witchcraft involved. No, that's not how I say involved. There's a lot of witchcraft involved with food with me. And I like cozy foods where you you can eat a comforting, cozy meal. And I have not been able to do that. So, I accept this recently. And then in the beginning, I wasn't even allowed to cook because it was bothering people. So it's just... So I wanted to let you know, Shia, I'm... And I'm not going to eat 10 different things on Thanksgiving. Shia, I, if they are playing with my voice, it's because they're trying to hurt you. And that voice is extremely ugly. And whoever keeps doing that to me, you are going to die in the name of Jesus. You're going to get, you're going to get tortured before you die, though. All the t all, whoever, whoever is doing this to me has probably either pitched in torturing me or is the, cr the actual criminals that have spent decades trying to kill me and torture me. So, I wanted to t tell you a little bit about how I'm planning my meals, but this is actually taking a little bit too long. Also, I, um,
I I have some things that I was gonna get you, Shia, and I went like that real quick. To, and I I'm sorry I did that. I just I, I wanted it to be a fun surprise, but I'll tell you a few things that I'm definitely gonna be getting us next month. I want to get um, I want to get a relationship book or a conversation starter book because of my brain. And because of your possession, probably, we're going to need to um, have a book that will help us talk about different things. Um, I want to get matching mugs, coffee mugs. I have these mugs, um, but I'd like to get, I have a set of four of these. Actually, actually, I, have, I think I believe I have a set of six, but I only use four. But I want to get bigger mugs and matching for us so that when we use the Keurig, we don't have to worry about balancing our coffee because it gets really high. I also want to get some more candles for us, Shy, with essential oils air freshener soap um, and I want to get you some loungewear and Shia they're trying to harass me and, and try to feel, uh, make me feel uncomfortable like I'm trying to get you to buy me things and I, I do not want you to buy me anything I, I don't want you to feel like I'm trying to suggest that anything like that uh, no I, I know that your, your situation shy and I'm happy that you are in that like that I'm happy that you don't have a lot of money it would be very very painful if you did it would be very very painful yeah, because of my lack of survival my entire life it would be very very sad uh, if you uh, had it uh, had better living, better off than me. So I have not been, I can't say that I've been budgeting my money these past two years and getting the things that I should have, like a bed. I should have gotten the bed. I should have had two chairs because I feel much more comfortable with our chairs. I feel a lot more comfortable in this room. Um, so I'm going to stop talking about the food now even though I'd like to talk more about it, but... I th I'm going to talk more about it in the notes. I think I wrote some things down about it. So luckily... I've been doing all this Lumerian channeling, Shia, and it's been uh, beyond boring. However, I've been able to multitask and do a lot of cooking and food research for us, for our family, for our career as a author, as authors, Shia. Um, let's now. I have the sticky note here, so I'm going to show you my photos. And Shia, um, I hope that my default photos didn't trigger you or you got sad because I noticed that there's a, a little ball here. I, I put the, the bar because of, um, no, actually I really like these photos and it was really about the water that, that it could because of our power or spirit, our powers that we have with water being mer people. But then I saw the bar. And I'm like, wow, these, these photos were created by the Lumerians. They set this up so that I would have nice photos to um, suggest to people, someone's going to go to the jail, be behind bars. And this one, me, my head, my head on the, my head on the, my head, my hand on my head. So... There's other things, 
but I'm not going to list off the different symbols of it. I already know that you see the symbols of it. And then the, I put on my Facebook default the Mount Shasta photo. And there's symbolism behind it, but I don't want to talk about it right now. Basically, it's our. It's I have I have a strong connect. I have a strong connection with the mountain, and your you, uh, your the mountain Shia, your Mount Shasta, and also we kind of Mount Mount Shasta. I have I actually feel uh, like we belong and own Mount Shasta in a way. Because of what I went through on the mountain, uh, because, because of my connection of, of Mount Shasta. So there was a lot of witchcraft on those old photos. Uh, and uh, the criminal DW was playing with my face to turn me into an animal. And I, every time I saw the photo, the AI, the AI uh, implant triggered the thought of the animal, and I looked at other people's human anatomy. It's not animal; it's human anatomy to actually look like what I look like. So we can talk about that a little bit later. But I'm going to show you photos of my food now. Six forty. I thought I started at six o'clock. So for breakfast, I had toast with peanut butter and toast with butter, and I sprinkled a little bit of salt on the butter one. This is whole wheat. Whole wheat toast is very important. Applesauce. Whole wheat toast, I guess, is really good for your brain. I've started uh, looking up uh, brain food. So here's the uh, tofu. I uh, made it nice and crispy. You, I froze the tofu, and then I put it in the refrigerator. Shy, they're they're playing with my personality to make you get triggered and make you act like I don't like you or you don't like me. Seasoned tofu with uh, this is the t uh, this is one of the best Asian stir fry that I made. It just has onions, bell peppers, baby bell peppers chopped, asparagus, and then I use teriyaki sauce. It tasted extremely good. I added some sesame oil, garlic, and ginger to the teriyaki sauce. I think last time I, I messed, up, messed up the teriyaki sauce, but this tasted really, really good. Uh, I had, um, this was fro frozen, I don't really want to call it leftovers, leftovers doesn't really, it's not really leftovers because I cooked it to put it in the freezer, meatloaf, mashed potatoes and pe canned peas, and the gravy, I put the gravy on the meatloaf and the mashed potatoes, I want to get some better gravy. I like the gravy granules, but they're not that great. And then again, I had uh, the tofu with a stir fry. This is the mung bean soup. This ended up being really good. Oh, this was put in my YouTube. It says, new to you. New to you. New. New to you. This is where the advertisements are put. A bunch of rats, rodents with cat, says cat games. Cat games, mice video for cats. Okay. I'm not really sure why this is. <sighs> and they're doing that. <sighs> like I'm like I'm so tortured with that moan. Like that's all my pent up uh, torture, torture and pain that I'm sighing out. Ever since I saw that article with Dustin the Fortune, um, how the neighbor heard him moaning, 
in pain but didn't didn't do anything about it so I think those are oh yeah then I had stuffed peppers with stuffed pepper filling peas I yogurt yogurt with granola and chopped chocolate Ch yogurt blueberry yogurt I like to get the individual yogurts because it's a good size and if you buy a big tub of yogurt it, it spoils quickly granola with chopped chocolate with blueberry yogurt so those are some things that I had today they just jolted me It's very painful when I get spasms like that. It's extremely painful, and they do it to my neck all the time to try to paralyze me. I found a note, Shia, crime report note from January 2023, where the criminal DW was jolting my neck, to, to jolting and yanking it and to try to paralyze my body. If I get more brain damage, I can't go into the courtroom and speak on behalf of myself. And that's what they've been telling me ever since I found out that I had a brain image. If I have another brain hemorrhage, and I'm not trying to scare myself or scare you, Shia. However, um, I they're they're really trying now to um, make me feel like I really got brain damage, making me uglier, making me act worse. They're really, really like trying to also give me another uh, brain hemorrhage. However, uh, Shia, Telepath Explorer told me that you know that because I'm making these videos and we have uh, created a stronger connection because we can talk ab to each other, I'm not going to get a brain hemorrhage. Because I told you in the last video, we have to be together in the physical uh, before I um, but no, you're you're you've been communicating with the posts, and things are uh, different now. Not are a uh, not not are uh, different now. So we went through the photos of my food. We talked about our cookbook, Shia. Uh, we have now. That I'm going to talk a little bit about. Oh, it's 30 minutes. I'm going to go into part three, two now. Thank you, everybody, for watching. Thank you, Shia, for watching. Oh, Shia, this is your photo with the candle to let. I'd like to turn the ocean sound on, but I think it's going to be too loud. It's going to be too loud. And here's our bed, Shia. I think it looks really cute. I think it reminds me of me and you, Shia. We'll get a different color blanket, but I think we have to keep it a light, a lighter color, to, because to make the room look bigger. Uh, someone just played with my face. And Shia, I don't know if you noticed, but the side of the side where I got the stroke is this side. And see how this curves in and this doesn't? I noticed it in the video. So thank God my lips not down here and my eyebrows not up there. But I have some work to do. And one thing that I do regret doing this past year is spending too much time laying down doing the food research. I wasn't um, doing, give it, doing enough breaks with movement and uh, what I've learned this week is uh, physical therapy and um, exercise and moving the body is not just for being um, fit uh, for looking good if you have to move your body for your brain if you move your body it actually helps your brain I, I don't know if I've I don't think I've ever learned that before, and I'm not, no, I, I don't believe I've learned that before, and I thought that when you get sick, you have to rest, but I recently learned this, this week again, they're going to push this down, 
make it worse, Shia. I recently learned this week again from just a, a one of my subscribe subscri one of the uh, subscriptions I'm subscribed to on YouTube that when you get very sick, well, there's sometimes you have you have to be bedridden, but when you get very sick, you have to move around because your body. Your body needs to move around, and being in, stuck in that vehicle and not feeling comfortable and safe to leave the vehicle because I had all my belongings. It was, it took three it, three years to finally open a storage to get all of my belongings as, belongings out of my vehicle. So all day long when I'm going to the bathroom, you better run back into that vehicle because your stuff's gonna get stolen, hundreds, thousands of times. So it's just, not it's just, and that's not even me the way I'm at, of responding, saying not it's just. We're going to start the next video. Thank you so much to Shire for watching, and they just made me stutter as well. But thank you so much Shire for watching. Thank you everybody for watching. And if you are, if someone else is watching, that's not Shia. Hopefully that you're watching because you want to help me and Shia. I'll thank you everybody for watching. Thank you Shia for watching.